everyone, what about here and welcome to Vampire Hunters. It is, I think, one of the first first-person shooter bullet heavens on the market. It's also absolutely ridiculous. Alright, let's see if I can actually do this game kind of justice. Uh-oh, can I not? Okay, there we go. Er. This gun. Oh, there's my ammo counter. Got it. And it's not, the, it's not a shotgun of any variety, so I'm not going to be able to, uh... Let's see, I'm not going to be able to just load it on a per clip basis. I'll have to see what happens when I level up. Hopefully I'll be able to get something useful. So I can get a minigun, uh, reward, new minigun, rifle, rampage, fire rate when HP is low, piercing. I'm gonna just have the minigun. We need a second weapon kind of on this, uh, lineup. Otherwise, I'm going to run into some trouble. Also, this music is really good. Ooh, missile? Minigun. Max ammo. Increases the weapon's ammo. Extra damage. I'm just going to strap the missile on. Yeah, that seems like it. That seems good. Oh. Don't forget that. I don't know if that thing chasing me gets any faster. Or if it's just, uh... Always the same speed. Familiar rats. SMG. It's for the familiar rat. Oh, it you no, know, it is it is also just perfect. I wasn't sure if it would be like scuttling around on the ground or anything like that. But it looks like we're good. I'm trying to be very specific about uh not leaving any EXP on the ground. Oh, there's the rats. There they go. Unfortunately we're up against a bunch of bats, which seem to be pretty uh sky focused. Which is an issue. Dragon whip. Well it's in red. Give it a shot. Okay, nothing left behind? I don't think. I don't want to get hit here either if I can. We've got some, like, rampage combos. Okay, infection. When dying, enemy will pass all debuffs to others nearby or a familiar cat. Just, um... Just snag those. Ow. Oh, we also have an F. What does the F do? Go! I don't think I want to press that button. Maybe it's fine. Oh. I guess taking damage is not actually that bad. Yeah, hopefully we can find some perks or buffs in some way, shape, or form that let me pick up things. Like, have a better pickup radius. I ran out of ammo. Oh. I goofed that. I pressed the, uh, reload button. Like a fool. I think we need more weapons. Otherwise, I'm going to keep running out. Revolver, minigun, extra damage, max ammo on the rifle. Yeah, I wonder if the... Oh, that's bad. I don't want to lose that. I don't actually know how useful it is. Oh, that's a bunch of enemies. Okay, it looks like I've got a couple... Ow, I'm just getting wrecked here. Eat bats and die. Boy, my pickup radius is abysmal. I think part of it is I can't see a lot of these enemies coming from, like, very far away. Which is not helping. Point blank deals more damage to the closest enemy, critical damage, or a flamethrower. Oh, let's go Dragon Whip. Okay, we have a bomb and SMG. I'm just going to keep going for SMGs. I think we might be having a bit of an incompatibility between a number of my abilities. Because it seems like some of them do not work based off of burst fire. Many of them seem to work based off of, like, single shot, so I have to click a bunch to actually use it. Oh, this needs some pickup radius. Personally, I think this is, like, the one of those games that almost shouldn't have EXP on the ground, considering how limited that, that pickup is. Okay, a launcher. SMG rampage. SMG critical. No, let's just... Let's just do that. And, like, realistically, we're doing not too terribly. I just wish I could see the enemies further out. Because I like the idea of this. I think this could be really cool. Uh, it just needs... It just needs a little bit more. Like, specifically, if I could see the enemies, like, kind of all the way out there so I could actually shoot them. Because I look away for a hot second and all of a sudden I'm being inundated in bats. It makes it a little hard. Well, we got the Bat-Bat. I don't know if that's like a melee weapon or what exactly. Oh. Look at all this stuff I missed. You're a big dude. Uh-oh.
Okay, he's dead. Uh, let's see. SMG critical chance, reward missile, AoE. Oh, you're close. Maybe, to some degree, I don't have much of a choice here. I did explode a lot of them. Please don't kill me. I had things to fear, and uh, apparently... Okay, gosh, I hope this game has some meta progression. Boss layer deals more damage to bosses. Uh, let's go for the missile. I suppose shooting his dick off works. I don't think I have any other options there. Boy, there's a lot of these guys, and I just don't do enough damage, do I? I suppose not. Yeah, I, this is definitely where the whole, like, wish I could see them from afar. Oh. I'm just gonna dodge that guy. Pick up all of these. Dragon Whip bleed. Killing an enemy that's bleeding. Grants additional blood. Game over. All right. Well, let's see what I get out of that one. Okay, so we've got some achievements. Uh, let's see, survive five minutes in a single run. All right, let's collect that one. Oh, we got a bunch. Cool. Okay, so first and foremost, we have achievements. Fire rate, sure. Here's the thing. Adrenaline dodge chance magnet. Here we go. Max level is 20. Oh. I just... It doesn't matter. Everything else would be nice. Oh boy, this is one heck of a lot of meta progression. 10% more gold, fire rate, damage. Let's see, heal. Oh, regenerates your HP by a little bit. All right, let's go with those. Oh, we have a bunch of weapons that I can't use at the moment. I think let's uh let's try the shotgun this time around. And that was the colonnade. I actually got pretty far on that. All right, I'm warming up to this. It's really the meta progression tax on these games it can be a little bit uh rough. Oh. This shotgun has no juice. Well, we haven't left anything behind. Hopefully that just massive amount of uh, pickup radius should make it much easier for me to never miss anything. Uh, shots push enemies back. Yeah, that's going to be helpful. Okay, familiar rat, sh shotgun crit, or ripper. Go for that. Ooh, Ripper Blades seem kind of fun. Maybe not that useful against the bats is the one issue. If I can get the arc correct, it's not bad. Familiar Raven. Auto fire. Hold the trigger. Watch the mayhem. More you upgrade, the faster it shoots. Elemental rifle. You can go for that Raven. Okay, the Raven might just be like an orbital which is way less cool than I thought it was going to be I like the missile if I can start with the missile that's I think very much where I want to be okay yeah Ripper is good for groups maybe not good here laser okay laser needs a little bit of damage But it does what I kind of want it to do. Okay, shotgun, boss layer, SMG. I think I'm going to have to nix the sound effects, though. Unfortunately, to do well here, yeah. Can I? Uh, options. Here, sound effects. I'm just going to kill it a little bit further. I almost kind of wish this wasn't on rails or had a time limit. I guess I understand why, but I almost kind of wish it was just... Like a race to the end, but it's just heck. Or just out in a field. I guess the one problem is you get a lot of enemies coming at you from behind. 
which could be messy. Do the elemental rifle. Okay, there we go. Well, the music is great. I should probably switch it up. Okay, death reload. Chance to insta reload when killing an enemy. Yup. And I'm a big fan of that pickup radius. Look at that. Previously, I had to walk directly on top of this stuff. Now it's just like, yeah, whatever. Uh, it's the extra damage increases. Yeah. Looks like the elemental rifle has a lot of the upgrades I'm looking for. In terms of just like mulching through large quantities of basic enemies. So I might uh, want to look into getting that as a starter. Okay. Orb? Orb. I don't know what the orb does. Have I properly re reacted to the fact that this game is just stacking multiple guns? I was kind of trying to lampshade it, but uh, I think it's an absolute brilliant way to kind of handle a first-person shooter bullet heaven uh, in, like, a really good way. I'm not wholly sold on it being a hallway fighter, but I'm not against it either. Boy, those missiles were just really good. Reload speed, increase reload speed. Yep. Okay, bat bat, familiar raven. Increase the weapon damage. All right, and I do have to actually hit the shoot button repeatedly here. Not all of the weapons let you do that. Or let you just hold it down, unfortunately that oh it's one of my discs just stuck in the ground oh that knockback is everything I could have possibly wanted for fighting the uh, the big red demons okay second hand revolver laser burns uh It is interesting that most of my upgrades seem to be packed largely on the right side for whatever reason. And I'm not quite sure why. Not hating, just confused. Okay, revolver extra damage. Now I'm gonna boost the laser damage, if I can. Revolver ricochet. Yeah, let's go for that. Yep, yeah, still haven't missed anything. Boy, that knockback on that shotgun, though, is just like... Hey, big dude. Bye, big dude. Okay, let's just send him off. I wish I knew what some of these did. Specifically the, uh, the familiar. Like, I still am not sure what orb does. Oops. Let's not get hit by that. Enemy behind? No. Doesn't look like it. There's a status effect as though there might have been. Or a status effect, a visual effect. As though there might have been. Okay. Hold the trigger. Piercing laser. I guess we'll go for the pierce. Unfortunately, Pierce on its own isn't particularly good. Oh, he lived. Fortunately, these suckers are a little tough. This one especially seems to be extra tough. Yeah, so I think that wall is going to get up close to me. However, I think we're going to be getting out of this with a lot of meta progression. Ow, death. Death approaches. Okay. I liked it when my enemies weren't shooting at me. I'm not so confident about dealing with that kind of thing. Mainly because I can't see what's going on. It's fine. Gosh, there's so many of them. 
It's really hard to actually avoid some of these shots. Uh, there's a bunch of purple EXP there. I don't know. I've not checked if I can jump. I don't think I can. Well, we did reasonably well. Let's collect some achievements. Uh, that was less than I was hoping for. Uh, let's go back for a second. What what weapons can we buy? Grenadier, Machina, Reaper. What is the Reaper? Oh, Ripper. Reaper, Ripper? Increased blood gains, gold drop chance. Soldier starts with a missile. Recovers HP when leveling up. Oh. Chance to drop an extra soul, though. Chance of ignoring damage. Weapons. I don't know. Maybe the revolver is actually quite good. Okay, let's see. So, gold chance. We should probably go for that. I think I'm actually going to put it there. Max level is way high. Let's see. Slow enemies. Extra soul. Up an extra soul. Yeah, let's go for that. Alright. And I'm going to stick with the revolver this time around. We almost cleared the colonnade. Yeah, I think it's going to take a couple more runs before we're there. However... It does feel like we're a lot stronger than last time. And that 25% chance to get an extra soul here should be pretty good. Uh, no, I think I'm going to go for that. I don't think we need stuff like bomb yet. I don't think that's going to help me. I'm going to try and go really heavy on the projectiles. The problem with AoEs and stuff like bombs is most of my enemies are coming at me in like groups of two and they're not next to each other. And many of them are flying. Which doesn't help much. Get the minigun. There we go. Unfortunately, some of these guns are auto, some of these are not. Okay, minigun, boss layer, shotgun. The shotgun's knockback was invaluable earlier. I'm definitely feeling more effective with the Ricochet SMG. Uh, let's see, machine gun, machine gun. Yeah, like I'm just wrecking them. I like that reload speed, but we're going for the shotgun upgrade. Being able to push enemies back was uh, really good. Crit chance, crit chance. I'll upgrade, I'll upgrade a couple of my weapons. Revolver, Rampage, Fire Rate, when your HP is low, let's just do crit chance on the revolver. Well, it feels like I'm leveling up a lot here. Which makes perfect sense. SMG reload speed, yeah. I'm going to go with a slightly less is more approach. Hopefully we can get a little bit more ricochet on a couple of my weapons. Uh, minigun reload speed? Yeah. Okay, boss layer, bonus damage to bo bosses? Yeah. I'm not entirely sure what counts as a boss here. Like, do those big skulls count? I have no idea. There's also kill streak bonuses I'm noticing. Uh, hold the trigger for the minigun. Uh, secondhand rifle. I'm missing a couple more bats than I'd like. It feels like there's a lot more bats this time around. Maybe it's just a me thing, I'm not sure. The one problem is the m amount of guns that I can have on the screen is making it a little tougher. Bat Bat, uh, Piercing. Unfortunately, Piercing is not nearly as good as Ricochet because, once again, most of my enemies are coming at me kind of at an upward angle. Okay. I think I'm just going to start assuming that my pickup radius is good enough. 
and I'm gonna stop looking behind me. I just don't think it's worth it. Point blank bonus damage? Yeah. I was gonna switch up my music, but I keep kind of forgetting to do so. Because the music that is currently playing is really good. Okay, boss slayer, more damage to bosses? Yeah. Again, I'm hoping those those red dudes count as bosses. If there's an actual boss, then I suppose I will be ready for them. I think I'm doing bonus damage to big chunkies here. I'm almost wondering for those skull enemies if I should actually just sprint forward. Extra damage with the machine gun? Yeah, let's go for it. Okay, minigun bonus damage? Yeah, let's go for it. There we go. Thank you, shotgun. Yeah, that pickup radius seems to be doing the trick. I need to give it some reload speed if I can give it. But, I mean, it works. It is a little silly that there are no weak points on the demon, so the uh, prevailing strategy is to shoot its dick off. Center of mass, suckers. Okay, max ammo for the machine gun, crit chance. I'm almost wondering with the floating skulls if the best strategy I could possibly engage in is just to sprint past them because I hate them. I don't think it's a good idea. But it is potentially an option. I think that gold drop chance is working better. Yeah, we're we are going to need that far more than we're going to need like damage pickups for a little while. Okay, minigun crit chance, yeah. Hopefully that just picks up everything. Looks like it did. I got debated by it their uh their orb attack, and I was just like, is that an item that I've missed? And the answer is nope. I mean, it does feel like I'm shredding through them pretty quickly. I do miss that missile, though. That missile was good. Also, the machine gun just lights folks up. Ow, took a bit of damage from it. We we'll want a little bit more meta progression healing when we get the chance. SMG reload speed. Nah, I'm just going to go for the critical chance. We need damage right now. Okay, boy, that's... That sure is a lot of money. That's also a freaking shit ton of skulls. Okay, achievements. Didn't get too many, but we got a lot of money off of that one, so I was correct. The extra gold was worth it. Well, I guess the gold chance, not the extra gold. Cover HP will not... Leveling up. Chance for a second hand to appear in the level up screen by 1%. Oh. Blood magnet again. I think I'm going to go for some damage for a bit. It's 
this. Fourth option to appear when you level up. That's actually pretty cheap. There we go. Okay. I uh, hate to say it, but I think I'm going to stick with Gunslinger. Try that song. Just to mix it up a little bit. I'm having a good time with this. The first run and like a little bit of that second run was just kind of like, ah, this is stinky, I don't like it. But now that I've been putting a, a little bit more time into it, a lot more meta progression, I am um, enjoying it. Let's go the reload speed. Probably don't have to, but I'm really hoping I can get that missile launcher. This is the real answer. Death reload would be nice, but I'm going to go for that ricochet. Because the problem with ricochet... The problem with ricochet on the SMG is it just didn't do that much damage. But if I can get this revolver to do just like ood oodles of damage... Let's just keep going for the death reload. This is a bit of a test of my pickup radius. Boy, if I can get another ricochet on this, that'd be kind of fun. Because the one question is, what if I only had, like, one weapon? I'd probably get stuffed by the demon. That's the actual truth. Okay. I'm not missing any, I think. Ricochet is so good. It's so good. I just want more of it. Uh, let's see. A sniper. Okay. Incre increase damage by distance. Probably not going to be Primo here. The boss Slayer or Crit Chance. I'm going to go for the Crit Chance because I'm not even sure what counts as a boss here. Those skulls didn't seem to be. Reload speed on that. We don't want the laser. Those are really small bats? They're really they're really small bats. Either that or I'm just they were always this small and I'm just somehow imagining things. Nah, they're they're definitely smaller. Okay, death reload on sniper? Yep. Cause my entire goal with this build to some degree is to have both of them just never run out of juice. Okay. Unless the launcher is the missile launcher. I thought it was listed as missile or something. Okay. Oh yeah, we're way ahead of the curve here. Okay, sniper, crit reload. I probably should have actually grabbed the shotgun there. Because yeah, the one problem with stacking just endless weapons is while they're while you have a lot of them, they're very good at taking out kind of your weaker enemies. Uh, the quantity of them. Okay, so this is where the lack of the death reload is actually absolute shit. Well, fine. Be that way. I suppose. Ah! Uh...
Okay. It's very clear we need a little bit more damage. Uh, the hell? Okay. I may have made critical missteps here. I think I figured out how to make this game more interesting. Hold the sprint button. Uh. Ah. Ah. <laughs> All right, I think we need some explosives. Okay, what do we have? Slending is down by a little bit. It's not the worst. Extra souls, nice. Oh, reload speed. It is, an, it is a thing here. Yeah, so I think we want one thing. One ricochet gun. Like the revolver that does the um, on-death reload. But I think everything else should not be that. Let's see. Do we want to slow enemies down? <laughs> Actually going to get one more level's in that. Oh, and increased combo time. Okay. And let's go back to this. I don't know what music's playing now, but I hope we get to keep it. Damn it. I think it's just the call. Hold up. I'm gonna quit out. Okay, it's not this song. We don't want this one. Let's go with that one. That sounds good. Okay, so we want we want to get the revolver to the point where it can just shred bats, and we want to sprint a bunch. But here's the thing: we don't actually we don't need to go forward necessarily. Pulse gun, because I think sprinting just causes more enemies to spawn. I know this is tutorialized. I just. Didn't realize that just, like, sprinting back and forth causes them to sp spawn faster. Extra range, extra ammo. Nope, just rifle. Yeah, the one gun that I think we do want is the shotgun. And I might try the launcher as well. See if that is, in fact, the missile launcher or if it's something different. I did like the elemental rifle. I like the sniper. It was pretty good. Oh, no. There was the missile right there. I am a fool. Okay, so the, the missile and the launcher are completely different things. There's the ricochet. Death reload. So I don't I don't want to invest too much into it. Shotgun. Okay, max ammo. Extra damage. Not like max ammo to go oh boy. Okay. Pusher, shots, go back. Let's slow down for a little bit. Clear this crowd. One more. One more. Okay, here we go. This is the strategy, kind of, sort of. Yeah, we just need... We just need a ricochet shot. Well, we have one just on the revolver. I was hoping I could actually get that multiple times. Because I could see that being uh, stunningly good. Okay, critical damage. Oh, dragon whip. You know what? I'm going to grab the dragon whip.
Okay, boss slayer, pulse gun, critical chance, revolt, uh, rifle, just damage. Okay. I don't actually know if that thing damages me or if it just pushes me along. I should really invest in, into a little bit more healing. Bat, bat, or bomb. Feels so much more chaotic than what we had previously. I think my last build was just much more slower and methodical, and the revolver was just able to clear crowds. Whereas this one's a little bit more generalized. Piercing Pulse Gun, Familiar Rat, and Raven. I really want the familiars, I don't think. It's kind of interesting how the entire goal is to, to just summon oodles of enemies right from the get-go. What am I doing? Not the greatest. Yeah. Oh, we got auto fire on the revolver. Which actually is kind of nice. Because I think a lot of my current weapons do actually work off of that. Uh, let's see. Revolver, boss slayer, pulse gun, max ammo. The problem is max ammo alone is not particularly amazing. Though, we just shredded that guy in, like, no time flat. And yeah, that pulse, pulse ammo is just as good as the shotgun, if not better. Uh, rifle extra damage? Yeah. Let's see, elemental rifle. Yeah. I don't think I've left any behind. So the flying bats are still a little punchy. Uh, they don't get knocked back by the pulse rifle. Whereas the big demons do. Secondhand laser. It's now time for the bad times. Or the good times, actually. We seem to be doing oodles of damage. It's the triple shooters that I'm afraid of. I'm gonna reach the end today. Yeah, if we see the sniper rifle, I might want to consider it, too. I don't think I'm gonna sprint, because as far as I can tell, holding a shift... Uh, it does make you faster, which can be useful for dodging things, but I, as far as I can tell, it also summons more enemies. Which isn't the worst. Especially because now I seem to be strong enough that I can actually punch through these guys in a couple of shots. Which is quite nice. Ow. I'm definitely going to want to get some more of that uh, regen. When I get the chance. Okay. So far so good. How did I not get hit by those shots? Oh no, I am actually pushing them back. I think it's just the shotgun could rarely reach them. Okay, auto fire shotgun, laser max ammo, auto fire shotgun. Feels like we're right at the end here, maybe. Oh, that's that's it right there. Sayonara, suckers. 
I'm out of here. I can't even see the wall. I guess I could have slowed things down a bit. The hell? Is that the boss? Bachelor. And I'm dead. I'll have to work on that. Okay, so what else do we want to do? Well, I don't want to do another run. I've got a lot. So, combo time isn't the worst idea. Bloody rush. Gold chance, extra gold. Second hand chance. I mean, that extra soul is kind of tempting. I guess I'll go for that. How are we doing? Do we have enough time for one more? I know I could be buying some of these. Reload speed by 50%. Ooh, that's really good. That's a good song. I'm jamming. All right. Yeah, so my damage has gotten better. Ricochet. Perfect. We also want that death reload, but the ricochet is infinitely better for what I'm doing. Especially if I can get the death reload. I think I want to sprint. Uh, revolver. Crit chance. Rifle. Okay, rifle piercing. Uh, let's see, trigger damage. Or SMG. I didn't care too much for the SMG. Okay, max ammo revolver. Now we want the pulse gun. We know the pulse gun is good. Increase range. There's a flamethrower, but I'm not. I'm not big on stuff like flamethrowers. I don't think. You're seeing extra damage. There's also the shotgun, but... Don't care too much. Piercing once again, rampage, critical damage. Haven't missed anything. Boy, the music in this is great. I sincerely hope it, uh... It's YouTube kosher. Missile. I don't know what its limits are, but I want it. Elemental rifle? Yep. Okay, revolver reload speed, yep. I'm still sincerely hoping we can get our hands on just one death reload on it. But unfortunately, I think by stacking a bunch of weapons here, there's no reason to let go of shift at this point. Who knows, maybe it's reload speed is just so fast that we'll just stay infinitely in the, uh, in, in the quick reload zone. I think I found the grind grind spot here. Okay. Freaking heck, auto fire on the missile. Uh, or Elemental Rifle Death Reload. Yeah, let's snag that. I've not paid any attention to its, um... Oh, we hit the small zone. How much time do we got? Not much, so I should probably... 
Stop messing around here. Extra damage on that. Okay, let's uh, stop sprinting for a little while. I'm taking a lot of damage because small bats are hard to hit. That's an issue. Okay. More death reload on elemental rifle? Yeah. We just have a quick reload revolver comboed with uh, functionally infinite ammo elemental rifle. I think that should be pretty good. I gotta be careful. I am taking some damage. Uh, let's do familiar cat. I don't even know what the familiar cat does. Okay, the bats have gone back to regular size, which means I can start spawning them en masse again. Yeah, I still don't know what the cat does. It makes a noise every once in a while. Corpse bomb, enemies explode on death. Well, we don't have the knockback, do, I? do we? Maybe it's not a problem. Look at the orb. Let's see, rifle extra damage, ricochet shot on the orb. Yes. I don't think it's quite as good. Oh, is it Q and E? Okay, Elemental Rifle Freeze stops enemies. Let's see, extra damage, corpse bomb, enemies explode on death. Missile explosion radius. You're finding way more fun abilities here. Unfortunately, I think we've exited the... Uh, the ideal grind zone, and we have now kind of hit the slow zone. Eh, no, the, I mean, these guys are worth a little bit more. I think I might be getting overpowered here, which is frankly good. Oh, we have way more money than last time, too. I have to say, I... This is definitely one of those games. I've had this a, a couple of times this week. Uh, let's see. Pulse gun. Extra damage. Yeah. I've had this happen a couple of times this week, but specifically the... Um, eh, it's just ripped through them. There have been a lot more really good games that I thought were kind of junky. That have... Um, Let's see. Like, good games that I think are junky that have completely sold me on them. Okay, I, I think I've got to stop sprinting at this point. I know we're, like, right next to the end, but that thing is getting kind of close. And I know we need as much EXP as we possibly can get. Okay, death reload, defrag. Oh, yep, yeah, the bomb is absolutely fired with, like, Q. It's a little unfortunate because I'm not using it. I'm going to check something. I'm going to check controls. Nope. Oh, you can actually see my extra damage and reload speed and certain things. Oh, alas. I don't think the orb upgrade was really worth it, and I'm still baffled by the cat. The 
But yeah, so first first impressions of this were kind of ho-hum. And now that we've gotten to this point, I'm like, oh no, this game's actually like really good. It definitely needs a little bit of uh, spit and polish, but I like it. Secondhand laser? Yeah, let's just go for an extra weapon. The one problem is a little hard on my wrist. I have been recording a lot lately. Okay, so he's summoning summoning rocks at me. That's what those lights are. Ow. Damn it. Okay, well. We got some good things. Uh we've still got a fair bit left. Uh, let's see. What do we want to do? Upgrade wise. I mean, the extra gold chance, I've barely even invested into. Same thing with the extra gold. That's probably maybe my best bet. Either that or just honestly the flat damage. Let's go for the combo time too. That'll probably help. Let's see. I don't know why it says plus 1% there, but it's fine. Either way, I think this is a good stopping point, at least for now. I had a blast with this. This is really fun. It still needs it still needs a little bit of work. I th think I wish some of the upgrades were a little bit better. Frankly, as much as I like the stuff like the death reload or the ricochet, like ricochet on the orb is meaningless. I don't even know why it's there. I wish stuff like the bomb was easier to fire to the point where I actually... I, I don't know. I, I don't like the fact that I have to press Q to use some of those moves. Maybe it's fine, but frankly, for a game like this, having a special ability like the bomb that you have to kind of aim and it's not even that good, uh, eh. Like, if it was a Star Fox style bomb, oh, baby, give me that. But as it's as it stands, stuff like the bomb is just kind of like, eh, why is this here? Missile Swarm would be good. A, like, uh, fire even faster, reload even faster upgrade. The bomb was just the big question mark. I don't know. I'm sure it's better on different levels. This one just, uh, this first one had a lot of flyers. But, with all of that said, if you guys like this video in any way, shape, or form, leave me a like, helps more than you know. And if you want to see more rad new games every single day, then hit subscribe, because I've got tons to check out and show off. And of course, if you guys want to play the Vampire Hunters demo yourselves, it's available on Steam right now. I'll leave a link in the description below. So just follow that and have some fun. But with that, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.